Raffaele, I see you are taking the Holy Father's directive to heart. No, I did not pray about you. I, like Nehemiah, am a man of prayer. Either kneel with me or leave me be. I will do neither. Like Nehemiah, who restored the walls of Jerusalem, I also am a man of action. Lay your hands on me again, Cardinal Borgia, and you will regret it. You believe you are a match for me? I believe I am holding cards which you do not wish me to play. Huh. You were about to say that the investigation of my brother's murder has never been officially completed and that I killed Juan. No, no, no. I am quite certain that you did not. But there is one person whom we never discussed nor interrogated. Your sister, Lucrezia. Lucrezia. Ridiculous. Before the Spanish departed Rome, I heard some rather intriguing facts from one of de Cordoba's lieutenants about that young man, Pedro Caldez, the one you killed. You pretend to be a priest, yet at every turn you act the politician. Unlike you, Cesare, I have known my true calling, the reason I was born, since childhood. I cannot imagine living life any other way. The priesthood has liberated me from all temporal anxiety, knowing that my reward of everlasting life awaits. Why do you smile? Because the Red Sea has suddenly parted. If you do not vote my way, I know exactly how to destroy you. You will be excommunicated. Obviously, your influence with the Pope has reached new heights. But even Rodrigo Borgia would never dare excommunicate a priest without sufficient ground. A moment ago, you accused the Holy Father's daughter of murdering his son. Bishop Flores dies daily in Terra Nuova prison for the sin of false witness. No one heard me but you. We did. My vote is yours. And with that vote, we bury everything that has been said here today. No more lies about Lucrezia. She is purity personified. And you will deliver Giuliano della Rovere's vote as well. Impossible. For a man of prayer, nothing is impossible. I will try. But even if I succeed, Piccolomini has turned against you because of your little cousin Juan.